Hey guys, so um, I just wanted to do kind of a quick video on what I might do for samples. Um, just a little bit of a background on samples. Um, a lot of consultants make their own labels and make them like super fancy. Um, but as, as I've said before, I work full time, I'm married, and like I don't have any intentions of making Sensi like a full time job. Um, so I do what I can. Um, I don't have a printer at home, I don't have a label maker, I don't make anything super fancy. Um, I try to make things as presentable as possible um, to make them like appealing. Um, but ultimately, you are giving your customer something to smell, something to use, um, and that is what's most important. Um, so, I guess I'll start with the super simple wax samples. So these are the um, felt pieces that are sold on the consultant store. Um, you can, if you have a local parter, party going to you, um, you can actually add these to a party and save on shipping. I do it all the time. Um, I love these because I mean, there's probably like 50 of these in here if I had to guess. I'm not really, 100, okay, cool. So that is super easy and simple. Um, you can make several of these and they're, they are flat. So you can mail these with one stamp and like a thank you card. So easy. It just gives your customer an opportunity to smell something new. Like this is the scent of the month uh, for January, Jade and Jasmine. And um, like my day job, I'll just literally sit at my desk and like in between emails and stuff, I will uh, whip these samples up. You can just put these in your warmer. You can get a candy melter. I just use my warmer. Um, sometimes I have like three warmers going and that way you can do like bulk sampling like this. But these are so easy. Um, you can even get like felt pieces I think on Amazon or like a craft store. I do like these because they do say Scentsy and these are pretty inexpensive. I think this bag of 100 is like $6 before tax and shipping. Um, and I get these little bags off Amazon. If you just type like mini Ziploc bags or something, um, these are super simple um, and like easy to mail with one stamp. Um, another item that is small, um, this is the dish soap. Of course, this is probably gonna go with like my local orders or if I send out some samples, um, I'll, you know, I'll include this. Um, it's not flat, so, you know, you can't mail it with, like, one stamp or something, but, um, you can definitely mail these in, like, a bubble mailer or something. And I literally got, um, some sponges, cut them in fours, and put just, like, a little bit of dish soap, let it dry. Um, I don't wet the sponge or anything, um, the point is for them to wet the sponge themselves and maybe use it on like a coffee mug or something small. Um, and these little Scentsy bags can also be found on the consultant store. I think you can get like 50 or 100 for, um, it doesn't say how many there are, I'm sorry. Um, but they're, they are very inexpensive. I think they might also be like six dollars maybe even like three dollars but like you get like quite a bit for not a whole lot of money um we made i made samples with my cousin last night and we made so many of these with like not a lot of sponges because we cut them in fours so that's a good option as well super cheap um also using those bags this is luna washer whips or any washer whips um and it, this is a whole scoop of washer whips. So if someone has a full load of laundry, they can absolutely put these in their um, their washing drum and, you know, they're ready to go. So that's a good option too. Again, this is probably going to be something that needs to be mailed in like a bubble mailer or just go with like local customers. The customers love this type of stuff, like, because they can try new products. Um, sticking with the... Um, washer whips. These are little bags. They're like the holographic bags. 
And at first I was like, oh, you can't really put a whole lot in there, but this is also a full scoop of washer whips. Um, and again, I don't have a fancy label maker, like you can see that there, it's like not super fancy at all, just says pink cotton washer whips. And it's just like a label that I got at Walmart or Dollar Tree, cut in half, and I think that's okay. Like, at least it's labeled and not just like, here's a sample, you know, people don't have to be like, what do I, what is this? They may, sometimes customers do ask, what do I use this for? And that's okay. Um, I think that's kind of normal, honestly. So these are super simple. Um, you can get a um, hundred of these on Amazon for $12. They're super cheap. Um, and my favorite thing to use these for is probably the Scentsy Soak. Um, this is a pretty generous amount of Scentsy Soak um, in here. And uh, again, same type of label and super simple. Because um, a lot of people don't realize that we do have body care products. I get that, a like there's body care everywhere, there's other direct sales company with companies with body care, but like get that stuff out there. Um, and it also, most of the body care is also in wax. So they can smell so many different things. Um, so that was really like all I had, but my cousin and I, who's on my team, we worked together for probably about three hours last night and we made so many samples because we just worked together. Um, and you don't have to do sampling with somebody else, but you know, if you want to, you absolutely can. Um, and, um, just make sampling intentional. Um, when I first started, I, people were like, do you have any samples? And I was literally like making stuff up like this and mailing them through the post office. And that got so expensive. Um, half of them didn't even order anything. So I am no longer doing that. Um, samples only go to paying customers. I know that sounds harsh, but if they want to smell something, I may send something like this and like a one stamp thing or um, the rub and smell stickers. You can also add those to a party or get them on the consultant store. Sometimes they do sell out, but lately I think they have been pretty well in stock. Um, but yeah, if, if no one's purchased before, they are just getting rub and smell stickers for the most part. Um, most of this will probably go to local or local people. I do have a very large local customer base. A lot of them come and pick up their um, orders. Some of them I do deliver. I don't do as many deliveries as I used to, just based on distance. Um, but I really hope this helped. It was really quick, super simple, but just know that sampling does not have to be hard. Um, do your research. Definitely look on Amazon. There's some really good deals on stuff. You don't have to spend a whole lot. Um, and it shouldn't take a lot of time either. Um, it only took a little while for us last night because we sampled a little bit of everything. But if you do like one day for wax, one day for Scentsy Soak, one day for whips, um, you can get it done, you know, in a timely manner. So again, I hope this helped. Um, if you need anything, I'm here. But I hope you have a great day.